In Power PPM, you can work with strategy. You can work with OKR, objectives and key results, and you can work with a roadmap of your company's activities. First of all, from the front page, I can access our strategy directly from this link. First, we're going to look at the roadmap for our strategy. I've created a commercial roadmap for 2024 to 2025 for my company. It has a commercial focus. So first of all, I've added a commercial strategy. In my commercial strategy, I've divided my strategy into two objectives. First of all, the Christmas sales boost. We're going to earn some more money in the Christmas season. And we will have a focus of the European go-to-market strategy, meaning that we're going to generate a revenue to our company. We want to have more market shares and we're going to open up 15 new stores in Europe. But Christmas is just around the corner. So to boost our Christmas sales, we will create an objective being the Christmas sales boost. I can actually already now monitor the performance is on track. We have realized our strategy with 65% and I can see the timing in my roadmap of those activities. Underneath my objectives, I've created three key results. First of all, create five new pop-up shops. We want to grow our revenue in the Christmas season. And we're going to hire in some new people, some new talents that should help in the pop-up shops to boost our Christmas sales. Let's click into the Christmas sales boost objective and see the very details. In my Christmas sales boost, I've put in a description that I want to focus on the pop-up shop concept. Right now we are on track. It's possible to change the KPI status. Right now we have realized 65% of our objectives with three different key results. With help of AI, I actually created inspirational information to support me in understanding how I could grow my Christmas sales. So with this AI capability, Power PPM created some examples that could help me in the Christmas season. It suggested me to increase the Christmas sales by implementing target email campaigns. It even comes with a three month duration proposal, 50 hours of effort and what kind of skill sets I need in my company. Throughout those suggestions, Power PPM also create the key result directly in the system. So I have now three key results created, create five new pop-up shops, grow the Christmas sales and hire 50 new talents in the Christmas period. I can monitor how I'm going to measure my key results. It could be by numerical uh, value, currencies, etc. I have a start and end date. I also have a performance indicator to help me understand where I have some issues around my strategy. Let's look into the five pop-up shop and see the performance of those. By looking at the five pop-up shop key result, I have a stage game mode where I can manage where my key result is. Right now, we are in measuring our key result. And what we can understand is that we have set up our key result to measure numerical values. It will have a start and target value, and it also have a start and finish date. There will be some contributors to the strategy. Most important is my result tracker. With my result tracker, I can actually see the performance over time for my strategy implementation. Right now we are at 60% implementation. I can switch to metric measurements and see in October, we already have three pop-up shops on the way and they are actually finalized. So when I look into the details, I can go to the list of projects and see the very individual projects that are driving the implementation of the pop-up shops. To the right, I would have a performance indicator by state and status. Right now, I have three projects in execution. We already closed on one. I can switch to the health, so I can also understand what project needs what support from the management team. I will also see that in the KPI status summary to the left. It is also possible to track and measure the budget and the actual performance and the actual invoices of those individual pop-up shops. So I can see that I actually have two pop-up shops. They have not even start spent money yet, but also identify 
one pop-up shop number two that actually spent more actuals than the budget allows. Probably the reason why the project is in red and it did help. So overall with the OKR and with the key results, objectives in Power PPM, you can monitor your company's strategy and you can drill all the way from objectives to key results, understanding the performance, see the timing, and you can even link it directly to projects.